So this movie doesn't hold back when it comes to violence. I imagine it's hard to get those scenes uh, realistic without hurting each other. Well, you got, I know, you burned Jerry in the face with a cigarette. Yeah, I burned his neck. Oh, wow. And he got hit in the neck. And I got hit in the, in the throat. It took me down for a few minutes. So, and then uh, Rick got his, his ribs bruised. So yeah. we all got our battle scars. Wow. But you can't make this movie without him. Well, you know, you grew up in Washington, D.C. Yeah. How was it for you guys to lay siege to the Capitol? Well, we were in Shreveport. <laughs> All right, the capital. So, yeah, the capital. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we built everything in Shreveport, so it was kind of surreal, to tell you the truth. And, you know, Dylan, you got your first big break in the, in the line of fire. That's right. How was it returning to the Secret Service? You know, it was great. I mean, I love the Secret Service. They're, they're a great group of guys. And, uh, you know, to be on the other side was, was kind of weird this time after being such a dedicated uh, uh, um, Secret Service agent in, in, in line of fire. So it was kind of fun to, to play the bookends. Certainly after, uh, in the beginning of my career and now, hopefully not towards the end. <laughs> in the middle, you know. Yeah. In the middle, okay. Yeah, we'll call it the, the middle. So, you know, in these kind of action movies, the bad guys have all the fun. They sure right? do. Right? How is yeah. it like uh, establishing your characters? I focused on uh, what this guy wanted. He lost his mother to an American landmine as a child. He saw that happen. So when that happens to a child, even though it's out of his control, he feels responsible. So his journey was to try to make up for that one moment, mm -hmm. which he never could. And uh, you know, I, I think about what the what the human needs are in everybody, which everybody wants a sense of love and connection, and to be able to you know have something that they're going to uh, identify with and to, to make up their own identity. My last question is, uh, is that first, you know, Hollywood had us fighting the Russians for a long time, then the Middle East, and now North Koreans are becoming kind of the villain du jour. What, do you, what are your thoughts on that? Well, I don't know who the next guys are going to be. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I originally it was the Icelandics yeah. Yeah. in this movie, but then we changed it. I heard the Martians Mars are going to come into it. Yeah. Yeah. Mars Attacks, right? Uh, 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 now we guys have like a, yeah. sell as a box set. Always going to be somebody. <laughs>